What's up guys, back with more 1v1s here, ranked 1v1s that is, of course, and hope everyone's doing amazing, hope everyone's living their best life, let's get it, okay, versing the Shredder, shout out to the TMNT 2003 series, my favorite, absolute favorite, actually the best ever, I'd watch it again if I could, I think it's on Paramount actually, shout out to you 2003 TMNT lovers, 810.5 goes, yeah, probably right. I mean, do I really want to take 834 here? Probably not, but it means that he's gonna not going to take 834, so I can go 639 into 834. The aura is really not all that much, so where's that wheat port at? And like, yeah, man, the wheat port's kind of nice. 956, 693. Start with the wheat and the free road. Seems pretty good to me. What's he going to take? Something like 6311, 611, 12. Something along those lines. Not having the ore to start with is kind of something, though. Something that we need, do need to think about. But we can eventually expand out here, right? I think so. There's no way he can destroy my port either. I like it. Let's take it. Let's just hope 11 doesn't roll right at the start and just go absolutely nuts, right? The brick port's also something, so we're going to have two really strong ports here. And this is a different way of playing. I mean, something that not a lot of people do, I think. Like, not taking ore. We just gotta hope that 11 doesn't roll a bunch at the start. Because we're gonna eventually get on the 11. Like, 8, 3, 4. Then the wheat port. Okay, so he does that. So he's basically trying to cut me off the ore here. But I'm gonna have this down entrance as well. 8 to begin and a 10. So 6s are huge. 9s are also huge. And we just need to dodge 11s, really. There, there we go, there we go. Okay, there's the 11. So let's go for the wheat straight away. I mean, we've just doubled our production right there. The nines hit, the sixes, like everything's really big here for us. Be nice to dodge an early seven as well. Okay, this is fine. Five. I think what we want to do is just get to the port straight off the bat. I do like getting to six, eleven, twelve, although. We'll drop a road here. No seven. Nice, nice, nice. Six is important for us. There we go. All right, so now we're on the wheat port and we can actually do a lot from here. I think we actually want to go here first. The brick port can be later. And we get a seven. Uh, what does he even need? I think we'll just hit the three here. It's fine. Uh, we may as well pop a dev. I'm happy with a dev here as well. Knights are really good. VP socks. Four. Five. Three is beautiful. He's going to pop again. And he doesn't know what we have as well. Yeah, so I, I do want the sixes to pop off. <clears throat> I also do only have one settlement spot, which is something to note. He could potentially monitor my brick as well. We have so much brick that I think I'm actually happy to pop here. Oh, wow. Double VP. That's really bad for us. It's hard to block us though. Yeah, and there's, there's an 11 and another 7. Yeah. Like, what does he even block, you know? Couple eights. Be interesting to see if he roads again here. Six is nice. We're just going to hold. And I actually want to roll a seven before he settles here. Because of the fact... Nine. Simply because he's just going to play the robber right back on me. Okay, so I'm happy to take a wood here, actually. it's It looks a bit strange, but we'll see. Seven out. Three is nice. Not if he has the mono. So he's going to settle. The four. And we can actually road, road settle on the ore now. And I think we need to do that. It's a bit pricey, isn't it? Jeez. It's very pricey. Could have road builders there as well. Ooh, I don't know if I love it. Ah, let's do it. Let's do it. Getting on a bit of ore is nice. I think it's fine. Could have gone to the brick port as well. Alright, there's the 7. Let's hit the 11. Take the brick. Use up a knight. This is fine. Okay. Now we need to roll a 7 here. So we outproduce him by a lot. Six is a big, 11's not actually a great block for him. I don't, it's like, I really don't need it. 
Once we get the city up on... Oh, 12. Beautiful. He might play an aggressive knight here. Yeah, not actually a bad move. Five. There's the six. So, we need the city. That's one thing. Ten. We outproduce him by a lot. And if we can force him to keep buying knights before he buys a city, it would be really nice. Yeah, like, we're just going to keep producing here. I should, probably should have dropped a road. Rolls a seven. He's rolled a lot of sevens. Take a brick. Port for a wood, okay. So he's going for 11-3-4. This is fine. Uh, I think I should just drop a road, right? Uh, should I, though? I might just port for an ore. What I'm worried about is that he monos the ore eventually. Five, we can hold. There's that 11. That's pretty bad. Might be a city, yeah. Seven. Do I play... Uh, I don't think so. I think we got to hold out, hold out here. Big six. Eight. Yeah, this could be bad if he has a mono. This could not be good. We'll see. Another six. Once we get the city, though, it's huge. Yeah, this is not good. Really? You got a mono? No way. Okay, thank God. He's just going to the port. All right, no seven. All right, we got there. We got the the city, and I think that's pretty good for us. We can eight, three, four city it. We can five, six, nine city it. I, th I like the both. I like both. I actually don't mind six, nine, three as well, you know. But we've got a lot of wood in hand, and the wood's not ideal. Once we get this city going, I do like the brick city, and then building towards the brick port. Let's... Yeah, let's rock with it. Let's rock with it. I'm, I'm happy with this. Let's go to the brick port now. Man, he's rolled quite a lot of sevens here. Yeah, the early VPs are like so big, right? Like it really sucks. Three is really nice. That would have been the settle right there. I'm just gonna have to pass here. Damn. Nice six block. Okay, so he doesn't have a knight. That's beautiful. So now we're going to get the brick port as well. Okay, this is good. This is good. He has 10 cards. I'd love for him to 7 out. That would be beautiful. Knight is perfect. 7. Beautiful. All right, we're back. We're back. He's going to get a sheep. We're going to block 11. Hopefully he doesn't have a pop. He doesn't. Give us something nice here. Wheat is fine. And from here, it's a pop fest, right? Does he have another knight? No knight. You really got the VP? We're just gonna we're gonna be able to out like pop him for sure. Uh, I can buy another dev here, but I think what we're gonna go for is production. So let's hold for the city. Wow. Mono? No mono. And an eleven. Beautiful. Okay, so do we have the city in hand? I don't think we do. No, we don't. Hmm. Also happy with another dev here, porting for wheat. All right, that's that's big. So from here, I can do something like this to manage my hand a bit better. Seven cards, 10. And if he monos the ore, then it is what it is. Yeah, he's buying devs. Six again, really holding out for that eight. How much wheat does he have? He's got no wheat. Still don't have the city. We're, f we're happy to just buy another one, right? Another knight is fine. And another ore. Hopefully he doesn't steal the ore. Wow, no knight. Okay. Alright, so it's still 11. 7. Okay, now he's been porting for wheat, so we may as well do that. So many roads here, man. Mmm, mmm. Do we pass... I'm okay with passing here. There it, there it is. That's what we're looking for. Oh, beautiful. That's money. That's 12. Now we get the 834 city going. I think it's 834 rather than 694 because of the Wii port flexibility here. Makes sense to me. And now we can get another subtle on the 3 to 1. Yeah, we're, we're not going to be taking road this game though. I think that's fine. Let's stretch out here. 
five. And we should just kill him with production, man. I'm actually going to play an aggressive knight. Take army and still a brick. Nice eight. This is fine. Nine, like, yeah. We're just destroying him. Eleven's his big money roll. That's nice to see that he doesn't have three VPs. Yeah, that's fine. You can do that. Ten. Get this port up. I think it's fine not to pop there. We've got a knight ready. We've got a mono. Yeah. This is fine. Almost want to keep the 11 open for a big mono, but it's, I think it's fine here. And we're literally just popping until we can't pop anymore. Can even take road from him. Okay, so he, he got double road builder. That sucks for him. Seven. So from here, I think what we'll look to do is... Uh, actually mono the 11 when it rolls. Four. There we go. <laughs> Just as I said it. Uh, boom. And we're so close here. Can't play the knight, can we? There's still a good amount of VPs left. He's probably got one, so what? Do we just do it? I will play it safe, whatever. Whatever, there's the win. Yeah, it's something different this game. Like, we started without the ore, but we took just insane production. And he just couldn't keep up with us. Leaves the game immediately. Plus 20, nice. And we're actually just been promoted to diamond. Awesome, awesome. 12 minute game. Yeah, that's what we like to see. Eights rolled quite a lot. 147 cards produced. How many sevens? I mean, yeah, he rolled eight sevens. We only rolled three. It's a pretty big difference there, but it's, the setup's just too insane. It's just too good, right? Yeah, you just you can't be taking the ore here. It's not, it's not good enough. And I think the second pick is actually pretty OP on this board, especially when he takes eight, five, ten. But yeah, okay, on to the next one, on to the next one. All right, let's get it. Aaron Winner. Pretty sure I have played him before in four, in the four-player base game. Shout out Aaron Winner. I think he's a good player. Yeah, so it's a clear six, nine, ten here. I mean, <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Probably a loss just, just from looking at this board, but we'll, we'll play it out. Yeah, we might even take 8, 5, 10, 11, 5, 6, but I'm not sure how much it even offers. If he doesn't take 6, 9, 10, then we win, right? Do we not just win? 6, 5, 10 actually could be something, but I don't think you bother with it. Just take the best ore, take the best wheat, and live your best life, right? Oh, wow. This must be some super big brain pick here. How do you not take the best ore here? 6, 9, 10. 6, 5, 4. 3, 11, 10. Hmm. What kind of thing? What, what is he trying to cook up here? 6, 9, 10. 6, 5, 11. Huh. I'm a bit stumped here. 8, 5, 10. Take the sheep. He's going to take 9, 4, 11. We obviously take 6, 9, 10 here. We have to. Happy with playing left. Um, I might have wanted to start with the ore, but I couldn't figure out the second pick. Okay, I'm actually going to think about this a bit more than I usually do here. Hmm. I'm starting to think something like 9, 4, 11 can offer a lot. Or even, do I just take 4, 5, 11 here? Just so I can have the 9 of sheep. And I cut off this. But he can do this. What the hell is he going to take? Yes. I just make it really difficult for him, I think. I start without the sheep, but I'm pretty sure we'll get 9-11 here. Unless he takes 9-11. Which I doubt it. Like, now he doesn't really have a great spot. He can go 11-6-3, but... I don't love it. You give me all this whole side of the board. He might actually... Yeah, I think he, I forced him into, like, an 11-6-3 here. Which I'm happy with, man. Once we can get the double nines going. 
it will be hard for him. He didn't point to a port either. He's going to be stuck in the middle of the board. His road building isn't as it's like every time he gets wood, I get wood. Every time he gets brick, I get brick. I have better ore. He just has the sheep on me right now. See what he does, man. Takes 10, 9, 5. So, I mean, he's playing without wheat here. Very, very interesting. I'm playing without the sheep. So, I, sh I probably should have been tracking his hand way better. He's got brick. He got some great rolls, actually. And he can nearly... F he can fourth one his sheep now for a wheat. And take this spot. But I don't need this spot. I, I, I like this spot as well. Six. Nine. So I got the city. I might actually just take the city here, man. The problem with the city is a seven, of course. Ah, uh, do I just risk it for the biscuit here? He's got it, no? Ten? Ten rolled. Yeah, he actually has it here. I'm going to drop a road here, and I'm going to actually build the city, I think. Screw it. Hopefully seven doesn't roll. So I thought he had the settle. He didn't settle. Damn, I should have settled the other place. The idea here is that I get two nines or whatever and I can port the ore for a sheep and settle, finally. Please don't roll a seven, man. There we go. There's one. One more. Yes, perfect. Oh, and I roll a seven. Let's go. Okay, so let's hit the brick here. Happy with that. Could actually be hitting the, the wheat, which isn't bad either. Alright, but our setup is a go. Nine's a huge, six is a big. This is the next big spot. If he can get to that spot, he'd love it. Okay, he rolls a seven. Damn, he gets the ore as well. Ooh, that's bad for him. Uh, did the four roll? No, it didn't. I'm going to hit the four. I'm happy with that. Twelve. It's just going to be very hard for him to expand. One six and he's dead as well. Absolutely dead. Even a five. Pops a dev. Okay, that could be an issue. Yeah, see that dev, that one ore that he stole gave him the dev. Okay, let's see what happens. Yes, no knight. Critical in that spot. And now he can double road here. And he will not get on that six of wheat. Double dev, of course. Two knights, like we're just set here. Ten. Seven. My bad, he actually was, he was getting ore from the ten. It doesn't, didn't matter that he stole the ore from me. Uh, two block is funny. I'll hit the brick. It's an interesting block. Okay, so he does need that wheat. That four. Another eight. He's just, he's begging for a four here. He can just port his sheep though. He's got so much sheep. So the sheep port's going to be nice. Eleven. Hmm. The hell do I do with this hand here? I play the aggressive knight and block the wheat. I think the three to one is good, generally. Yeah, I'm happy with dropping road here. Okay, seven. So he'll get an ore. Buys a dev. Wow, he wasted that wheat. Wasted that precious wheat on a dev. Oh, I don't know about that move, buddy. We have the knight here as well. Huh. Also have the city. I'm happy with settling on the three to one, I think, and buying a dev, right? I just, I don't really love, love giving him ore here. Road builder. Okay. Yep. Oh, big 12. Uh, just give me that ore back, please, and I'll be happy. Beautiful. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, okay. Fair enough. Takes the brick. 10. Yeah, it's worth it. It's worth it because... Okay, that's something. Do I just mono the... The wheat that he ports for, for, for the gags? 9. He also just has a lot of sheep here. And I think it's worth just ripping it. 5 sheep, it's whatever. Let's get a knight here. Perfect. He just, he just can't do anything without the wheat, man. So I just got to keep it blocked. Yeah, that's another city for us. Um, yeah, look, it's so easy for us to get cities. Let's pop two devs. 
five. Oh, he got the wheat. Nicely done. There you go. He's got the sheep port now. Let's hit two just for the gags. Three. Big nines. Huh. Uh, I do want to be mindful of a mono. But he has four cards and no wheat, so it's whatever. Okay, so he clearly doesn't have the mono. Otherwise, he would have just ripped it. Yeah, let's just up the production here. There's an argument for 9-11, but I'll just take this. 10. He's about to be all settled out here as well. Two wheat. Ooh. Yeah, let's do it. Let's try to get a wheat here. I'm happy with that. Brick. More brick. I'm happy with a pop. Two road builders. All right, all right. Four. I might actually... Nah, I shouldn't go for the wheat. That would be funny though. Let's play a road builder. Get to that 4-3. Two settlement spots open. He doesn't have a mono. He has a VP. Yeah, let's hold. Eight. Gets the city. Seven. Fine, let's hit the eight. Am I actually... T it might be ten, actually. I don't mind the ten. And, yeah, let's just... We'll port the ore here. It's fine. Eleven six three, Another road builder. I don't mind it. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. The two. The two. He has a wait for me. Okay, let's hit the four. Nice. This takes the ore. Give me the ore back, please. Sheep. That's actually fine as well. You have plenty. Ten. Five. Oh, let's just pass. There we go. That's the roll we want. Yeah, I could yacht for a city here, actually. Um, I could just get two devs as well, which is equally as good or subtle. We don't actually produce that much sheep. Let's get some devs. More knights are fine. A VP would be nice as well. Four. Twelve. I'm happy with settling here. Get the sheep production up. Perfect. And he takes a wood. Nice. Play that knight. I think we just constantly block four, four or ten. It's one of those two. Maybe it's the ten now. Uh, we can hold this. If he wants to mono brick, he can do it. Ooh, he kind of thought about it there. Five. Let's get rid of the brick in our hand. From here, this should just be like two cities and we win. There's one. Ports for a brick. He might be able to take road from us though. A four city. Uh, I may as well extend here, right? Nah, nine wins near the game. Four. Mono in the wheat? Nope, no mono for you. Okay, takes the wood. Uh, do we have the win if we, we block the brick here now? Yeah, that's the win, no? No, it's not. Damn. Crazy that we got the ore though, no? Wait, is it? Can we steal a wood from him? He ported all his wood. What the hell do we get from him? Wood or ore is winning. Dude, how many VPs are there? Do you pop a dev? Fine, we'll pass. 12. And 11. That's GG. Should we try end it on a VP? Nah. We won't flex. That's another big win there. We're on a big streak right now. Do I go for one more is the question. Let's check the leaderboards real quick. We'll check the stats if you guys want to see that. How many sevens did we roll? We rolled, what, seven sevens. And he rolled five. Yeah, it's decent. I just think you can't leave six, nine, ten open. I don't know what his play was there, but worked out for us. Jeez, no threes. Yeah. It's just too weak. Like the sheep, you overload on sheep. I know you get the sheep port, but it's all about the wheat in this game, man. It's all about the wheat. But yeah, let's uh, see what we got cooking on the leaderboards. All right, number two. And we've bumped up the win percentage to 61.7, which is where we want to keep it around that mark. And yeah, I got obviously this guy who finished number one. Let's, let's click on his profile. 
I could have taken it from him, man. I just slept in. God damn it. He's from New South Wales. God damn. God damn it. It should have been me. All right. One more. 